So first of all, I started um, school um, quite early, and my mother's, you know, pro- probably one of my biggest uh, critics, right? And you know, I got into uni at 16 um, and finished uni and, and did my masters. I was just turning on 20 actually when I finished my masters. So, um, so. I, you know, I did go. Th- I went through school quite quickly, missed, skipped a few classes, but at the same time, I think there's been a lot of people um, around me that, um, you know, including my mother, my sisters actually were very, very much have, have the same trajectory as, as I've had, um, and friends and so on who are, um, they, they teach you so you don't have to make the same mistakes. So you ask questions, you listen a lot. Um, there's no such thing as a stupid question. There's no such thing as knowing everything, right? And the, the power comes in knowing when you don't know everything and who has that information and who you can always tap into to get that information. And that's really what it comes down to. Initially, I actually wanted to be an architect. Um, and I, you know, for people who've known me, I'm very much um, into sort of structure and design, um, beauty, you know, and, and, and finding beautiful things. I'm a bit sort of visually groovy, I like to say. So I, I really wanted to be an architect. And um, it's really funny, but I remember my mother saying, you make money as an architect too. And I swear to God, I started thinking of <laughs> other things. But I've always been in tech and, and sort of, I was very much a geek as a child, um, very much into sort of computers. And it was really between being an architect and being an engineer. But, Building things, creating things, that's always been a passion. I actually would love to drive. Um, It's not something that we can do, unfortunately, at the moment. Um, But in some cities, we're starting to, um, you're starting to have employees drive um, and and what we do is that money then goes to charity, so we're structuring that in every market um, so that employees can actually you know, drive as well. And I really would love to, actually. One of these days, very soon, you'll have Amy picking you up and asking for the AC um, <laughs> and the radio. It's okay. <laughs> I think there's something called the social self itself and the sort of true self, right? And the social self is what you know, everybody has told you to do and what society has forced you to do in out of circumstance and all of those things. And there's a true self, which is what you are in your element when you're not worrying about, you know, all these other things. Of course, it's hard. You still need to pay rent and still need to pay bills. But, you know, tapping into that true self only comes from a real curiosity about the world, about making and making an impact and you know, doing good. Like really, when you go back and you sleep in your head, you know that, okay, I can sleep at night because I am doing good. And I think that that true self is what we all need to tap into. And that's what that's where the real magic happens, right? That, that sort of, you know, when you wake up in the mirror and look at yourself and say, you know, what am I doing? It's not because your parents said or because your friends are or because of any of those constructs. How can you be your true self? And I think ultimately with any career that's what it comes down to being at you know your your purest form as close as possible to your purest form and that only comes from you know that sort of the the good and the real sort of passion for questioning for understanding why things are the way they are right i think if we all did that we all questioned more if we all sort of dug into things um you'd see so much more magic that's why artists and musicians are usually their true selves or close to their true selves Hey, what's up, guys? They call me DJ Spinner, a.k.a. The Cap. You enjoyed the video you just watched? Please, please subscribe and Danny TV. Just click below and subscribe and you can watch more amazing videos.